Hello everyone, and welcome back to Muscle Gerbil Plays Echo. We're deeper into the palace. We're starting to learn the ins and outs of the clone's learning abilities. So it's time to keep exploring. The environment's changed. It's no longer as bright anymore. It's a little bit more muted. Looks like we got some clones coming up already. I'm gonna try and get better at using my area scan. Which did not do much this time. Okay, one coming this way. We're gonna see how close it wants to get. Oop. I'm still not a hundred. See, how did it see me? Push it down. I don't know why I closed the door. They know how to open doors when I when I do that. But we got away. What is that down there? Let's go see what that is. Whoa. I got prompts on each side. It's it's an organ. Can I play the organ? Ah, it's just piano. I figured with the big. Okay. I did not know that one was right there. Okay, so that's kind of a uh, a lure. That's a new way to lure them. I was hoping Ed was going to play Moonlight Sonata, Jill Valentine style. This, this palace is dangerous. Still trying not to run as much because if I teach them how to run, they just they're right on top of you each time. Does area scanning take energy? I forgot. Yes it does. So I need to maybe scale back on my usage of it. These pillars do not provide much cover because of the space in between them. But they don't really hear me that much when I walk. One of them saw me. Alright. We're gonna sh Try and shoot the gap. Run. Oh, run, run, run in. Can they run now? Or do I have to wait until the next cycle? Oh, they're just dropping down from places now. Alright, I've got enough gun charge. Alright, since I shot them during the blackout, they shouldn't know how to use guns next time. Oh, oh no, oh no. Dead, dead. Oh. Swarm. Just swarmed. Okay, so we know that's not the way to go. Let's change up our strats. There's a lot of energy around. Just gonna take this nice and smooth and slow. Need to start using the doors to my advantage to get around them better. Ah, see, I didn't notice that one last time. Can I do an aerial takedown, Assassin's Creed style? I pressed the wrong button. 
Don't shoot it. Don't shoot it. Don't want to teach him how to shoot me. I don't want to run either. Um, any little mistake is just amplified. Any mistake you make is just... It, it will come back to bite you later. It seems in this game, so... If you do the wrong thing, and you teach them how to get better at hunting you... It just, it's gonna be a world of hurt later. Okay, we're in the blackout. This is probably the time to use my area scan when... So I can get the outlines. Alright, I seem pretty safe down here. Got a... Got a peony here. Okay then. Nice little tune. I prefer more maybe like a, a ragtime piano song, but that'll do. There's a lot of pianos everywhere here. Ah, yes. My bashing orb. Definitely gonna take that. I'm gonna distract this one. Or not. Oh, wow, they're just... They're flooding in from the ceiling. I'm gonna sneak into this room. Okay, I'm safe. Ooh, save point. Perfect. Alright, I'm full up on energy. I'm gonna have to get through this room. Oh, of course there's a... patrol right next to the heart piece. Doesn't see me, doesn't see me. Got him! Just go to sleep. Go to sleep. Need to get this energy. Don't mind me. Need two more and I'll have more energy. Hmm. Couple different paths to take. This one seems the safest. I really wish I had some kind of solid snake. You know, press up against the wall. Oh, it's coming this way. Back up, back up, back up. Okay, we're gonna go... want to go investigate that room. Down the steps we go. No one sees me. Is it already on its patrol back? No, it's not. Another tuning fork. Perfect. And some energy. Wonder if they can hear sounds through the door. Still have yet to determine how good their hearing is. Take that orb. Oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Not good, not good. Just gonna... Just gonna tear ass out of here. Oh, no, I just thought of how to run. Okay, I think I'm safe. I feel a blackout coming on. Paul asked a Lollapalooza. Hope there are some grapes. That's a man cage. Do tell. You don't want to know. 
is horrible. What's a man cage? Where is said man cage? Oh, there's a heart piece up there. I need to get to that. How do I get up there? Gotta peel back a little bit. Looks like there's a hallway that's leading from the left. So it's through this door, but I can't. Oh, can't get through that door. Hmm. I must have missed something. All right, well, we're gonna log that in the old noggin. Hopefully we can come back to that later. Oh, why do I keep running? I need to stop running. Oh, is this going to be another one of those blue orb gathering missions? Oh, it's a harp. Okay, I can use the harp as a distraction, it looks like. I'm just going to kind of sneak around. No, I just got to get to the center. I have to get to the center around... Oh, a, a lot of them. What's that sound? The whole floor is shaking. What the world? The floor is gone. I guess I'm going to have to learn how to raise up that floor to get to the middle. Got some energy over here. Crap, something's on me. Yeah, come on. Come on over here. Alright, one more heart piece and I get more energy. Uh, I cannot make a run for it. How? How? How did that one see me? Why are you putting chest high walls if they can just see right over them? Mm. No more, no more stealth when it comes to bashing these things. Just gonna walk right up to him and say hello. One hot on my tail, isn't there? I should have time to hit that. Okay. We're just gonna keep going. So I have to get there during a single phase. Because if I don't get there during a single phase, they just respawn. I hope I can run away from this one until another blackout happens. Oh no, now I'm just, I'm, I'm kiting too many of them. Just don't run. Just don't run. Don't want to teach them that. Don't, I'm not going to have time to pick that up. Oh, come on. No, no. Come on. No, no. Darn it. Dead again. Alright, what is the plan here? Because I have to get to that thing. I 
There's at least... There's at least 20. There's at least 20 copies in this room. Or echoes. Oh, there's a couple tuning forks in this room. Alright, I should be safe. At this exact moment in time. Oh, ooh, I just barely got that takedown off. I wonder if that's like a massive one. I'm just going to haul ass and grab it. Not a good idea! The key door is below the floor. Okay. I've got the scepter. But I am... So the floor is gone. Not in a good position. Oh, that was close. Okay, I don't think anything's down here. Oof. <laughs> that was intense. I'm going to explore a little bit down here. Might wait for another cycle and just kind of reset reset them for the next room. I wish I could use the scepter to to bash them. <laughs> Only dreams now. Is there really nothing down here? I don't know if I want to go up again. Oh no, I do. Get the other tuning fork. There's something on the other side of this door. Just push him down. Ah, this is how I get that energy piece I saw. I really wish I could press up against the walls. Alright, come on. Oh, wow. Narrowly avoided death right there. Just gonna hit that again for good measure. Ah, oh, thought I got that prompt off before the light came back on. Oh, oh, I could have sworn I pushed her. It's okay. It's okay. We're okay. Just, you know, one more hit and we're dead. Did I forget to grab one of the energy pieces in that other room? Oh, do I risk it? No risk, no reward. Just 
get a little detective vision going. Yes, there was an energy piece over here that I missed. I just need to remember where it was. I think it's on the other side of this room. As I said earlier, sense of direction. No bueno. But this room shouldn't be that tough now that I don't have to run directly into the center. I just have to get to the floor when it drops. I think it was in this other room. Yes, it was. Come on, come on, come on, just grab it. Just go, just go. Alright, we're safe. Now we have four bars of energy. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, nothing really ever good happens when we open up these types of doors. Oh, maybe that's a man cage? Is it kind of like an Iron Maiden, I'm guessing? Can't open it up and examine it. Alright, let's place the scepter. Quick threat assessment. No threats detected. Threats detected. This place is horrible. How could anyone enjoy themselves surrounded by man cages? Is that one just gonna stand still? Okay, it's on the move. Let's see if we can get behind first. Please, no one hear me. Please, no one hear me. It heard me. It saw me. Sneak past. Nope, no way to sneak past. Oh, I could have sworn I made it past. It's okay. It's okay. Just, just hide. Oh. Oh. oh no, this one's like glitching and stuck to me. There are not a lot of good hiding spots in this game. Oh, that was, that was nuts. That one is still hunting. Okay, I don't know what happened there. Missed button prompt. Oh, I should have shot him. I can shoot him when it's dark. Oh, my aim is terrible. Unless they're point blank. Okay, got them both. I need energy. This next cycle is going to be super dangerous. 
now they can shoot and bash me. Hopefully once I get through this this waypoint I'll have a spot to just reset them. Just keep going. Oh, another airlock. Perfect. This one opens automatically. It's fancy. Don't want to be in the airlock forever. Run, run in. Back in the underbelly. We're just gonna just hoof it down to the planet core, aren't we? That's probably where the soul sucker is. Probably like powers the planet somehow. We're gonna cause a catastrophic meltdown. It would be kind of fun to have some sort of Metroid-esque escape the planet sequence with Echoes just swarming you. God, I'm gonna die a lot during that if that happens. I can feel a strange pulsing from those cylinders through the suit. It feels like a really loud bass. It's not sonic. The field print tells me they're hyperconductors. The force supplied to sustain them ripples the suit somehow. Veins flowing with answers. Come again. These are what's making it all possible. To keep sync on a planetary scale. Every few minutes, every blueprint is maintained meticulously. Imagine if the palace was populated. The chaos of input, analysis and reaction. All that wasted on some sick game. A game that will bring Foster back. I just need to beat it. We've seen nothing here that proves Foster can come back. That's true. On the contrary, the echoes aren't you, N. Foster will not be Foster. He's dead. But he's not. That's what I keep saying. He didn't die. He was translated. To you, it's so fresh in memory, your adrenaline is pumping. But in reality, he died more than a century ago. And you hope to bring him back. It's just crazy. It can be done. Grant's explained it to me. But I doubt you'll understand. Try me. The apparatus translated Foster into a Kaya supersymmetrical manifold. A corresponding neutral field was captured in solid form, the cube. He really is in there, still alive. And the palace will re-manifest him. That is just ridiculous. The manifold is a theoretical shortcut. Not even during the push was it pursued to that end. My guess is it was. When else would this place be thought up? I figure some rich house considered this their retirement plan as the requisition jitters started to gain momentum. You just speak whatever comes to your mind. How do the echoes fit into this nursing home theory of yours? <laughs> nursing home. you've seen it all, you really are very narrow-minded. Reality is diverse, and the push era was notoriously considered the era of splintered humanity. Spreading through the universe brought about extreme human constellations. Don't you try giving me history lessons. I'm just saying that the wealth needed to develop a tech like this, keep it secret. Their grotesque imagining of paradise, it all matches a recluse house. The echoes were probably entertainment to them. Seeing the lower castes fighting to survive. The creators expected to be gods here and designed everything to constantly remind them that they were. And the resourceful spend their lives preparing for the challenge of being gods? I suspect Grant's ticket here wasn't first class. More like gate crushing. That would mean fighting to gain privilege and access. Constant betterment. That's what Gramps prepared us for. And that's exactly what's needed to finish this. Well, that was quite the info dump. Um, so... Foster wasn't dead when he was translated into the cube. So his his soul, his spirit, his essence is just trapped in there. Oh, 
Is this going to be some kind of some kind of pet cemetery situation where we bring Foster back and he's all corrupted and evil? Or maybe Foster was already corrupted and evil and we're trying to do a reverse back as a good person. I, I don't like this plan. I, you know, this seems very far-fetched. I'm kind of on London's side here. This all seems like a fantasy. Oh, I don't like the airlocks. We're in another structure. Let's see what this one holds. No threats on the threat ring. What are these big ones? I wonder if this... I'm gonna waste some energy. Let's see what these do. Alright, down to one. Okay, the big boys give you all your energy back. That's good to know. Firing my gun was probably not the best idea to do right there. Well learned a lot this episode. We've gotten some more backstory on the palace. We know that Foster is... and believes Foster is trapped in the cube. And that London, he's not so sure. I'm starting to... starting to take London's side a little bit after all we've seen. So we're going to enter this grand ballroom next time.